the weather is unpredictable here in Texas. As you can clearly see, we do have some clouds in the sky. We're predicting to have that um, for Monday, but we're crossing our fingers and hoping to have some clear skies coming on Monday for the total eclipse. clouds there will be or what, if there'll be high clouds or low clouds. I've heard that high clouds are not as bad as low clouds. So I, I would say I'm definitely nervous, but I'm trying to just think of it as I've never been to Texas, tried to enjoy the weekend as a whole uh, and, and keep a, a positive spirit because I, I would say I'm generally a little nervous about the weather. Welcome to Texas. Where are you from? Well, I'm from Atlanta, but I live in Chicago. Okay, okay. When you look at the entire state of Texas, we're the best part. When you look along the entire path of totality, your best part is Maine. Okay. That's a little far away. That's a long walk for even a Texan, I'm just saying. <laughs> Months of the year, uh, because I can actually rotate this. It's sounding like here in Dallas, kind of early morning, we are gonna get a very thin layer of high level clouds come in. Uh, but they're thin cirrus clouds, so they're transparent. You can see through them a little bit. Um, they've been describing it like a veil. So you can see through it, but is it an ideal condition? No, but you're also not clouded out. In Texas, we're the first major area that's gonna be able to see something. Again, it won't be ideal, but we'll get to see it. So, <laughs> it's a little compromise, you know. <laughs> I'm a sun man. I remember. 